we are going to do some observational drawing today. This is a little bit different than some types of drawing. Observe means to look at. So when you're doing an observational drawing, you're looking at something and you're drawing exactly what you see. You're not using your imagination. You're not thinking about your cool ideas and putting them down on paper. Instead, you're using your eyes to look at something very, very closely, see all the things you can notice about it, and then record those things on paper by drawing. You're going to need a pencil and some crayons from your bin. You're also gonna need some plain paper. And then you're gonna need something to draw. I'm going to draw these leaves right here. I picked these leaves from a bush and I made sure that there was a lot of leaves on the bush and I just took a little bit. I picked this because I, it looked interesting because I saw that there was two colors here, that some of the leaves are green and some of the leaves were kind of purplish brown. So when I draw it, I'm gonna look closely and I'm gonna draw the colors that I see. I'm gonna draw my leaves. And the first thing I'm gonna do is to really look at them. I look at them and I notice some of them are purplish brown and some of them are green. How many of them are purplish brown? And how many of them are green? Do they grow right across from each other or are they kind of taking turns as they go up the branch? I notice there are little lines inside of the leaves. And I'm gonna be sure to try to draw those too. So I look and I draw. I'm gonna start with a big, the stick that goes across and then the leaves come across from there. I see they kind of have a point at the end. I look and I draw. I look and I draw. Oh, this part is a little bit broken right there. I can draw that little broken part of the leaf. I'm trying to draw it exactly as it is on this, in, in real life. That was hard work just drawing those, but now I'm gonna add color. Some of them are green. Some of them are brownish purple. If I don't have the perfect color, I can try mixing colors or I can just use the closest color I have. I'm gonna try mixing purple. So I'm gonna do really light purple and then I'm gonna put brown over it for the purplish brown ones on the top really light purple. Then I'm going to put the brown on top. Oh yeah, it kind of looks like that color. It's not exactly the same, but I'm just doing my best. Okay, now the bottom ones are green. I hold the paper with one hand so it doesn't move and then I can draw with the other hand. While I'm coloring it in, I don't have to really look at it a lot because I'm just focusing on getting the color nice and strong inside of my leaves. Now my stick, I'm gonna color it, but what color is it? Oh, I look closely. Oh, I notice it's brown. Okay, then I color it brown. Oh, I worked so hard. I looked at my leaves so much. I feel really, really proud of how hard I worked. Now go find a leaf or some leaves that you can draw.